Yeah, De'Aaron, uh, I think the story of the night, the first half slump, uh, the inability to hit three-point shots, and then the free throw shooting, just what was it that you saw despite you having such a big game? I mean, the first half, I think we got, you know, shots that we wanted. We got a lot of open shots, and uh, we just didn't make them. You know, I think we made one three in the first half. Uh, so shots really just weren't going down, and, you know, they kind of uh, took the energy out of what we were doing. But, um you know, second half, we really picked it up offensively and defensively. We started making shots. Uh, you know, I, I think, you know, where we lost this game, we could talk about the first half and not making shots, but, you know, free throws. Uh, I missed seven. I think we were uh, 22 for 37 overall. So, you know, we're getting to the line, but we got to, you know, if we make free throws, then, you know, it could be an entirely different game. Sean Cunningham. Yeah, kind of along those lines, when you when you see that maybe poor shooting can kind of take you guys out of a game, was it seeing the ball go down in the second half that kind of got you guys going a little bit? Um, a little bit, but, you know, I think we gave up uh, 66 or 68 in the first half, and it's like, you know, you're not going to win many games giving up 70 in the first half. So, uh, you know, I think our, our defensive intensity definitely picked up. I think they scored like 18 in the third quarter. And, um, you know, when we got back in the game, I think shots started falling a little bit more. Um, you know, we got some layups, some some uh, some some steals, forcing turnovers. You know, getting in getting in transition. Um, I think that's what really brought us back in the game. Jason Jones. So, what changed for you guys in the second half in terms of just your defensive physicality and aggression? Because it seemed like in the first half, their front court was really aggressive against you guys, but you were able to kind of turn that in the second half. Yeah, I mean, um, just that. I mean, being aggressive defensively, um, you know, trying to get the ball out of B.I. And, and Zion's hands. Obviously, everybody in the league knows what they can do. Um, and, you know, they, they have to see multiple guys. But, you know, we were – we just scrambled a lot. You know, we did some switching. Um, you know, we'd send a guy go to go down uh, and, and try to dig the ball out. And once they make a pass, we scrambled out. We got a lot of deflections. Uh, I'm not sure how many steals we got in that second half, but, you know, I'm pretty sure it was a, it was a good amount and we were able to get out in transition. So – uh, just defensively, we 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 wreaked we a little bit of havoc in the second half. Um, I think it was similar to how we kind of came out and played against uh, Utah, how we how we defended a little bit. So um, just trying to be able to do that throughout the course of the game, you know, would have definitely uh, made this a little bit of a different game. Jason Anderson. Hey, Darren. I wanted to ask you about the free throws. That was obviously big. Um, you know, as as hard as you guys have to work just to get calls sometimes. You know, is it just that more much more disappointing that, that you know you can't convert when you get to the line? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, for us, uh, you know, sometimes they don't make the call. Sometimes they do, but you know, the only thing we can uh, only thing we can control is if we go there and make it. So, you know, when we are getting to that line, and when I'm getting to that line, we we, we definitely have to convert. Um, you know, we're doing better as a team, and tonight we just we weren't we weren't, we weren't making our free throws and. If you know, I think we, we we missed 15 free throws, lost by what eight or nine, whatever it was. You know, it's a it's a different game if we make you know half of the ones we miss. Sean Cunningham. I was curious just to know what you kind of thought about you know when you have the the first half that happens, the second half effort is a lot better, and then obviously it takes a a game like you had to really kind of bring you guys back. Is that encouraging as you go forward? I mean, obviously the losing streak is what it is, but I mean it shows fight. But at the same time, is it unacceptable given the effort that you see so early in the game? Um, I mean, I wouldn't even say, you know, the effort wasn't there. I just think, uh, you mean, at the beginning of the game, like, it was it was there. It was hand in hand, and then, you know, they, they started making shots, and we weren't making anything. Like, you can literally, like, I remember a few, maybe three or four wide open threes in the first quarter that we just missed. So, um, I definitely don't think it was effort. Um, but I would definitely say that, you know, wh wherever we were, we picked that up um, in the second half you know, defensively and offensively. So, um, you know, for us to just just be able to try to start the game with high energy um, and, you know, don't really let our – don't really let us missing threes or missing jump shots, you know, really dictate the way that we play throughout the rest of the game. And I think when we came out in the second half, you know, we, we left that first half behind us and we played a much better game. James Hanna. Yeah, De'Aaron, the way that you put this team on your back in the second half, I mean, clearly you are taking steps as a leader and you're trying to get this team over the hump. Is is this actually, when you look back, do you think there might be some moments where there's growth here and that you can take something away from this, even though the losses are piling up? Yeah, I mean, um, you know, we come out in the, in, the, in the second half down 20, 24, whatever it was. Um, and then bring it back. So, you know, we, as a, as a team, we know what we can do. Um, 
And for us, like we said it before, it's just be consistent, be more consistent with what we're doing. Um, you know, don't let, you know, missing shots dictate, you know, how we're, how we're defending the ball, how we're, how we're rebounding, um, how we're getting out in transition. Don't let that affect anything else that we're doing. And um, I think the first half, it definitely did a little bit. Um, but in that second half, you know, we were, I mean, we were a much different and a much better team. Um, you know, we were still getting the shots that we got in the first half, but, you know, we, we started to make a few. We, we made a few of them in the second half. So um, I think the growth was, you know, not, not laying down, you know, being down 20 and bringing the game to within, I think, four, you know, and I missed that three at the end. So um, we, we, we know what we can do, um, and we just can't, you know, dig ourselves. We can't put ourselves in a hole like that in the first half.